All right, hey guys, how's it going? T-Man Plays here with another Warno video for you today, and we're actually gonna be doing something a little different, a live game today. And we're gonna be playing as the 35th again. So let's just see kind of where we wanna go. Uh, since we're airborne, we'll try and go on the far left here. So from one of my last videos, I did switch out these uh, helicopters from the 110 point MI8s just to the 50 point transports. That way I can bring a lot more of these in. And that's going to be important because we're going to go for a little backline action here. Try and get a lot of infantry behind his line. Let's go ahead and do six of these. So that's going to be important in cutting him off for our main advance. This could go horribly wrong, but who knows? We'll try it out. <laughs> Let's see. We'll get another squad here. And we'll do our last one uh, in the front here. And then we want to basically... See, let's do a bunch of BMP, BMD twos. Let's just charge those straight through. We're gonna need some A support in the form of these gas trucks. Get four of those. Just kind of position them around and we're going to need at least a heavy tank in case he does have uh, some sizable armor and let's go ahead and hmm kind of want the recon helicopter just to shut down uh, any type of infantry push that gets through. If he does bring a plane, that's going to be an issue as we won't have the AA up to back it up. Um, what else would be extremely useful? Maybe a Conqueror's here in case he gets through all my infantry, but I don't expect him to get through all my infantry at the start, so we're going to actually get just another A piece up that can do some more damage to planes and whatnot. And go ahead, get two supply trucks. Ah, uh, didn't spawn them in time. Two supply trucks just to send up in case our infantry does end up surviving. And let's see how we do. So we hear a lot of vehicles already moving through here. Should be interesting, as it looks like we're up against an airborne division. For the other side, yeah, a bunch of 82nd Airbornes, some French. Okay, looks like we're up against a French player. So, MI-24 here, going to be doing what it needs to do. Ooh, we do spot a little command there. Yeah, that's going to be an issue, though. <laughs> well, we know he has a lot of AA, but we're still committing with our MI-8s, so let's just see what we can do here. Uh, the ones that are landing closer up, though, we need to land a little bit further in the rear. And our AA is starting to show up now. Let's go ahead and get... Uh, let's do the BMD-2s. And I think this looks good. Let's go ahead and unload everybody. Yeah, so we do have an 82nd Airborne player here as well. There we 
go. We get CV there. This guy's going to be used to cut off the rear reinforcements. Go ahead and start moving some of this infantry around. And it looks like we're going to be able to get some artillery pieces there as well. As now all our helicopter is going to fly back to the front. And we're starting to see some of the devastation that we're causing now. Which is awesome. So BMD-2s are going to be showing up now. Get them to the front. Then we can unload them. Now let's go ahead and push up a CV in here. As well as get conquerors on this side with some recon. Uh, friendly fire here. A bit tragic. That's all right. As we now have a new reinforcement wave coming in. And let's go ahead and move up some of these UAZs to where we need them. And we can start trying to cut off the right side there. So spreading out our BMD-2s, which is awesome because we just missed the strike from the cluster there. Uh, we are going to need some rear security so we don't get cut off here. Let's go and move these guys a little bit. Okay, that's a cluster, so we don't need to worry about that. And we can go ahead and move up our tank here. I uh, don't quite want to move him up just yet, though, because he does possibly have infantry there. So what we're going to do now is get some more helicopter infantry that we can land here. And some more of these BMD-2s. And that should be enough infantry for us. This guy really needs to stop moving so he can repair. We can keep pushing up with our infantry. The AA pieces up. We'll reroute one of these guys to the corner here just to have some security. These guys can back off, and our BMD 2s can move through there. Now let's go ahead and get some more supply up. Be really nice if we could start healing this. So now we're going to try and cut off the opponent over here. Our CV does get in. We're going to actually just leave that there. Let's go ahead and try and cut this guy off with our tank. Now let's get a little bit more A. Looks like our, okay, our helicopter is starting to come up now. Just gonna land them right there. Now let's go ahead and move our infantry up. As well as the other infantry. Move up our BND 2s just a tad. We'll get this conquerors in this far out building. So we can possibly get some side shots. Move up our snipers there. Now let's go ahead and try, try and start capturing some of these buildings behind him. And let's move in the BMD-2 here for support of our infantry. I'm gonna pull this guy back. So there actually is some forces there. And let's go ahead and get some helicopters up. Test out his AA now that we've kind of pushed him back a bit. And let's move across our AA pieces just a bit. Help 
uh, with some of these helicopters we're coming into contact with. Okay, well, that's fun. Let's go ahead and pull back our injured infantry. Let's do a safer spot where we can resupply. Now let's go ahead and pull this guy back. Okay, that's a, that's a bit of an issue. That's a big problem. <laughs> Alright. Um, and our game crashed. Awesome. Well, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the start to that one. And I'll, uh, I'll catch you all in the next one. Later.